Somebody call the law. Somebody call the law. It got to be illegal for me to be so wrong. What up, though? Heist man, the folk talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions, man. Everybody love wrestling. I love wrestling. You love wrestling. WCW, ECW, NWA, AEW, all the wrestling, Raw, SmackDown, everything. I love it. You do too. There's such things as Mount Rushmore's, your favorite wrestlers, your, you know, all the lists that everybody make out. This time I want to do my own list. I want to do the Black Mount Rushmore of wrestling. Everybody got their own Mount Rushmore. I think the black wrestlers, they should have their own Mount Rushmore. Let's get into this. I want to show you a few people who not on Mount Rushmore, first of all. Um, and this is my own, this is my opinion. I got my own criteria that I want to make these four guys the Mount Rushmore. So take it with a grain of salt. It's my opinion, not yours. You got your own opinion. First of all, I want to say Bobo Brazil. He not on Mount Ru on Rushmore to me. He did his thing, but I ain't familiar with his work. Heard he was like the first superstar of black wrestlers. He not on the list, though. But honorable mention, big shout out to him. The same with Tony Atlas. I ain't familiar with his work. A little bit before my time. So that's why, you know, I don't really put him on the Mount Rushmore. You, you know, he did his thing, you know, but, but whatever. Abdullah the Butcher. His forehead look ugh, but he ain't on my list either. <clears> There's <throat> a lot of people that's not going to make the list. I'm just going to show y'all who they is, though. Before I give you my list. <clears throat> Junkyard Dog. Big shout out to him. Him and I say um, Coco Beware. Them like the first two black wrestlers I ever heard of when I started getting into wrestling. They not on the list either. Honorable mention. Big shout out to them. Um, Shelton Benjamin. <clears throat> One of the best workers that I seen in wrestling. That's a black wrestler. Big shout out to him. He not on the list though. Our truth did his thing. Um, he got some longevity too, man. Our truth like 112 years old, but he's still doing it. You know, he held that down for that um that one belt, the 24 hour belt. He be rapping. What's up? What's up? Y'all know what I'm talking about, man. He dope. Let's get into some of these dudes who won the belt though, as of, um late in the modern era. Kofi Kingston. He not on Black um, Mount Rushmore to me, but he's still dope. Big shout out to him, along with his um partner, Big E. He won the belt too. I think Bobby Lashley he won it. Also, they not on my Mount Rushmore though. Y'all tell me who y'all Mount Rushmore. See now we finna get into it. <clears throat> this is not the Mount Rushmore, but this is some people that you know I think that could have made it. Um, who should be. He like my number five. This dude right here is my number five on my Mount Rushmore. <clears throat> Hold on, let's see. Mark Henry. Here we go. The world's strongest man. Big shout out to him, man. He not on my Mount Rushmore, though. He dope, though, man. The world's strongest man. Beat up a lot of people. I remember he had on that salmon suit. He did his thing with that suit on. He came back. I thought he was going to retire, but he didn't. So, you know. Honorable mention, Dusty Rhodes. I know y'all thinking Dusty Rhodes not black, but Dusty Rhodes, he did so much for the black wrestling community. He put a lot of black people on. He did his thing. He Like, he got that hood pass, man. Big shout out to Dusty Rhodes, but he not on the list, man. And that goes with Ric Flair, too. He has so much swag. Everybody love Ric Flair. They get them passes, man. They get the pass. But Dusty Rhodes and Ric Flair, you know, they not on the list. <clears throat> now, we finna get to my Mount Rushmore. Mount Rushmore is only four. This is the four greatest wrestlers to me, black wrestlers, on my Mount Rushmore. First of all, I gotta put Ron Simmons, Farouk. I think he was the first black man to um, get the title, wasn't he? WCW, he did a long thing, the APA. Ron Simmons, he got to go on my Mount Rushmore. Number two, King Booker, Booker T. Tag team, Harlem Heat, did his thing. Five times, five times, five times, five times, five times. How many times you gonna say that, man? But, you know. Can you dig it, sucker? Um, Booker T. Number three, I gotta say, Devon Dudley. 
Yeah. I put Devon Dudley. He won them belts, man. He did a lot for wrestling. Him and his brother. Um, his white brother. You know what I'm talking about, though, man. Bully Ray. Uh, Bub Bubba Ray, whatever you want to call him. But he on my Mount Rushmore for his longevity and what he did. And what he's still doing. He behind the scenes, I heard. So he gots to get it on my Mount Rushmore. And last but not least, on my Mount Rushmore, I got to put New Jack. Yeah. New Jack. ECW. New Jack. The reason why I say New Jack on my Mount Rushmore is for the simple fact. He was like the only black character that was allowed to be a black character. He was black. Unapologetic. Did some... He did some crazy things, man, <clears throat> in that ring, outside the ring. R.I.P. to him, but he gots to go on my Mount Rushmore. And that's my Mount Rushmore, man. My personal Mount Rushmore, my my opinion. Y'all tell me who y'all think I should have put on there, who I should have took off. Big shout out to them. I know what y'all thinking, man. Hold on, let me see if I got this right here. I know what y'all thinking. Y'all thinking I forgot somebody. Let me tell you why I forgot this certain person y'all think I forgot. Hold on, let me see if I got the picture. Right here, boom. I messed up. The Rock. The Rock, he could have been number one on somebody's list or whatever. Two reasons why I kept Rock off this list because one, he um he identified more with his Samoan side and he, you know, he only black when he need to be black. That's my personal opinion. And his daddy wasn't black. His daddy was wasn't African American, his daddy was African Canadian. You see? Mm, black people. African Americans, uh, you know, it's a <clears throat> it's a touchy situation. That's just my opinion, though. So, Rock, he could have been number one on the Mount Rushmore list of of yours, but not mine. He don't identify with black people like that. I mean, he more Samoan. He do more for the Samoan people. That's his thing. That's his people. That's his mama who he raised with. Big shout out to him. But when it come down to the black Mount Rushmore, and his daddy was, you know, questionable black. His daddy wasn't black black or African American black he was Canadian black so mm, that's just me anyway I go live on the channel every Friday at 9pm talking about all kind of stuff man y'all come through and holler at me hit that like button comment button the share button the subscribe button put in the comment section who your um, four Mount Rushmore black wrestlers tell me am I wrong who who I should have took off who I should have put on did I miss somebody you know it's a lot of black wrestlers still doing their thing Um, just got a chance I ain't say nothing about um Keith Lee. Not the chef, not the um critic, food critic. Y'all know what I'm talking about, though. The other Keith Lee. It's gonna uh, Apollo Cruz or Creed or whatever y'all wanna call him. Y'all know what I'm talking about, man. There's a lot of black wrestlers still doing their thing, how they did their thing. Some I might have forgot. Viscera. <laughs> um, but yo, that's just my opinion. Yeah? Like I said, I go live on the channel, come through and holler at me. Hit that like button on the way out. Fuck with your boy. Heist man the foe. Talk that talk, ghetto news and opinion. This is a dangerous group, is it? Groups that we're dealing with now. All right. This time, but I'll be back. And sooner than you think. Wherever there's prejudice, ignorance, inequality, I'll be there.